Getting up really early is always one of my favorite times of the day, especially when you're in a place you've never been before. And this isn't the most exciting town ever, but the mornings in different places are just different. And I think sunrises and sunsets are the best time to kind of really capture like the beauty of an area to sound like a total hippie and to see weird crap like this. What in the world is this? Like a rocket ship? I mean, obviously not a whole rocket ship. So today, we're going to the Grand Canyon. We'll be heading out of here in a little bit. Gotta get ready, heading to the Grand Canyon. Uh, first time my wife and daughter have seen it. It's been 12, 13 years since I've been there. So really excited about seeing this. Um, we've been talking about it forever, and now we finally get to do it. So enjoy day two. you guys that have never been to the Grand Canyon, pretty much any way you try to get there, no matter what direction, it is, it's, there's nothing. There's absolutely nothing out there except for desert and some Indian reservations. And I got my reservations about them. <laughs> Ooh. Anyways, so there's nothing. And then you start getting some trees and some hills and it's pretty, it's really pretty out there. But you would never expect there to be this huge hole in the ground. And I would bet you that there's a whole bunch of people that went out there, like 1800s, 1700s, and, and they were like, man, you guys are a bunch of liars. I didn't see anything out there. There's a bunch of dirt, a bunch of nothing. You guys are, I hate you guys for, for, for sending me out there, jerks. So you're driving up, you check in with the ranger, pay your, pay your 20 bucks or whatever, and you're driving through and it's trees, and you pull off in the parking lot, and then you walk up, obviously not this fast, this is sped up, and then it's just like, holy shit. Like that's the only word that describes it. Sometimes there's just some things that you see and it's just like, holy shit. And the Grand Canyon is one of those holy shit kinds of places. So there's all these different spots like along the rim that you can stop and check in. Like every view is is a little bit different and just as amazing. So we kind of made our way along all these different views and stuff and and you just, you could be there all day. I've got like tons of pictures, a bunch of family pictures and stuff and, and it's one of those things where you go through and you're like, this is so freaking awesome. There's just, there's so much beauty there. It's really hard to not just take a, just a crap load of pictures. So that's what we did. Because I, the boys were saying something. She goes, short visit. I gave them. D, what'd you think? $20. Good. What, what was good about it? We got to see the Grand Canyon and it was awesome. We went downstairs and we took pictures, but I did, but I did a lot of them wrong, but the last one was good. What was your favorite part about it? Sleeping at the hotel. Wait, no. Wait, what? Your favorite part about the trip so far is the sleeping at the hotel? What? The bed was comfy. You like that better than the... You like that better than the... Than the Grand Canyon, than that? Well, the Grand Canyon was pretty cool. What, what, what was cool about it? There are a bunch of rocks. You can climb them. All right. Why do you want me to cut? It's hot. Oh, too hot to film? It's too hot. Too hot for what? To, to look cute. Too hot for video. To look cute. It's right. a little bit windy. It's a little, I like the just wind. a little. Just a little bit windy? It's a little bit rock and roll. All right, one last view before we, we buy the Grand Canyon. Before we wrap it up. Bye. <laughs> 
Where are we going now? To the car. Where are we going though? Telluride in Colorado. Here we go. Okay, remember when I said that there's like nothing on either side of the Grand Canyon? Like there's nothing around the whole Grand Canyon. You get close to it, there's some trees and stuff and it's kind of pretty, but then there's just absolutely nothing. So like, this is what I'm talking about on the other side of the Grand Canyon on our way out. And this, and there's some of this. This is actually pretty, but there's not very much there. So we're driving some more and you get through Arizona. We cross the Four Corners, we're close to the Four Corners. So, I wanted to keep filming this, but my f the thing broke. This thing's brand new. So I get all these cool shots. I say something funny about being on the road and how everybody gets irritated with each other. And then it happens. Anyways, we're in, I don't know, middle of nowhere, Arizona. And then it's nothing and it's nothing and it's nothing. And then you get to Cortez. And after Cortez, it gets really pretty. And we're getting really close to finally getting to Telluride. And then finally, we're here. 